Hey PL Hearts, welcome to my channel. I hope you guys enjoyed my last video. So I'm back again with a new look and I'm calling it an all over gold glow. <laughs> I was inspired by my hair and my various bronzers, um, the Laura Gala and the Nas Jubilation palette. So I hope you guys enjoyed this look. Let me know what you think. <laughs> so I'm starting off. By priming my face with the Skin Denivea Primer and then I'm applying my foundation which is a mixture of MAC Match My Stuff foundation in 8.5 and Black Opal Stick foundation in Beautiful Bronze. These are my um, go-to foundations. I love them. I love to mix both of them together because um, they are easy and has an amazing coverage and it's not so heavy on my face so I'm applying this foundation um, foundations <laughs> with my real techniques core collection brush you love me thank you for loving me and you hold me thank you for holding me and you keep me so I'm going to be highlighting my face with my favorite concealer, which is LA Girl Concealer in Fun. Applying that with my um, Beauty Blender. I love to use Beauty Blenders because they smoothen up my application and I don't see any harsh lines. So I do suggest that you use a Beauty Blender to blend in your foundation. Going to be contouring the sides of my nose with the MAC Concealer Palette. And I'm just doing that with my angled brush and also going to be contouring the sides of my face with my angled brush. Blending it out with the Beauty Blender. Highlighting the bridge of my nose and my forehead, my chinny. <laughs> Blend that out. As usual, for no hash lines. Then I'm going to be um, contouring the sides of my face, my forehead, applying the Laura Mercier translucent powder underneath my eyes, bridge of my nose. This powder is the bomb.com. <laughs> like I love the fact that it doesn't give me um it's not heavy but and it, all, it just covers everything. So I'm applying foundation on my eye area as a base instead of using a, an eyeshadow primer. Then I'm setting that with the Laura Mercier um, translucent powder. Thank you. Thank you. Filling in my brows. Blend that out with my brow spoolie next. You want to go gently, uh, and with every retractable pencil, make sure you do not over scroll it up, just use the amount that you need um, with retractable brow pencils. So, I'm going to be highlighting my brows with the mod 410 brush which is my absolute favorite i've been using it since i since i left makeup and i don't think i can use any other type of brush to highlight my brows now i'm highlighting my brows with the black opal truly topaz foundation blending that out and i'm also highlighting the top of my brows too with the same mod 410 brush now i'm going to be using powders as my eyeshadow um, color for the lid powders are awesome as you look especially for when you want to go out and it's not so much uh, you know you don't want so much heavy makeup but you could use powders now I'm applying the a powder which is um, fashion fair stable to my crease area this color is really very good especially if you want to use it to um, contour the sides of your nose now I'm using this purple blush from Makeup Forever. You never believe that I use purple. 
I do not believe it as well too. <laughs> and I'm going to be also using the color from the Too Faced, the brown color from the Too Faced Chocolate Bar Palette, just to intensify my eye look. <laughs> And then I'm going to also be using the MAC Mineralize Skin Finish Powder in Deep Dark. My best powder, by the way. Because mineralized powders are good for oily skin. So if you have an oily skin, use mineralized powders. And I'm going to be contouring the sides of my face with the um, CoverGirl Bronzer in Ebony. And lining my eyes with Kiko Milano. This is the best. I'm not joking best 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 gel liner in the world it is water based i think and the coolest thing about it is it does not dry up i have tried every other type of gel liner none in fact this is the bomb.com <laughs> so i'm using that with my sedona list angled brush and i'm just flicking it out making sure that I do not overline because I'm going to be fixing my lashes next and I'm drawing that outline drawing the line out of sorry excuse me and you see just follow that this step if you want to get like a very good winged liner um, for your eyes Now I'm going to be fixing my lashes and I'm using these 605 Red Cherry Lashes from Bianca Beauty uh, and I also got the shoe glue from them as well. Uh, this shoe glue is black so um, it just mimics like a, it just it just like adds to your lined already lined um, eyes. So I love 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 this glue because it just sticks once and for all. Um, I'm also going to be using the Maybelline, the, sorry, the Benefit, their real mascara. Like, look how I'm just, like, I tried, you guys. I didn't open my mouth while I apply mascara. <laughs> so, um, just look at my nose. <laughs> oh my god. So, I love this mascara as well. Uh, I'm going to be blending that out, blending out the translucent powder underneath my eyes, you know. <laughs> Massive shout outs to my mom who came to check up on me and made me laugh. <laughs> so I'm applying the um the Jubilation um bronzer from NAS and also the Laura Gala Glided Honey. Perfect combination for brown skin girls. And then I'm going to be highlighting my nose, you know, pointed. <laughs> and, yep, just the right spot. <laughs> uh, so I'm applying this color underneath my eye, my lower lid to my lower lid <laughs> with the 410 brush. Yes! <laughs> now, this lip. It's just cool. I mixed coconut oil and my Broken Elf Cosmetics bronzer to get this lip color and I couldn't believe that it turned out this amazing. So what you want to do is just mix any bronzer that you have with a very nice oil. I love coconut oil like that's my best oil and apply it to your lip if you want this metallic lip color. I mean I can't really be spending so much money right now you know we're trying to save so check this out i mean like it's so cool i can't even imagine if i had like another shade of bronzer how it would like look so amazing yay finally done with this all over gold glow applying the scandinavia finishing spray and i hope you guys enjoyed this video it would mean the whole world to me if you like this video subscribe and share with your friends who will be interested in learning how to achieve this kind of look or just watch my video thank you so much love you guys <laughs>